Welcome to this next tutorial on why Drupal is SEO friendly. Out of the box, Drupal is search engine friendly. What you type in in your title tag is very important in optimizing that page to rank well in the search engines. If you take the extra step and use the KEI feature in Word Tracker, you can research to see if that keyword that you want to rank for has a high KEI score. In this mind map, you see the clean URLs have been enabled. The second reason for Drupal being SEO friendly is something called clean URLs. Later on, I will show you how to turn this clean URL feature on. If you look at the URL path here, easydrupaltutorials.com slash drupal slash seminar, by enabling the clean URLs in the path auto module, whenever you write a blog entry, video blog entry, page, or store, or any other content type, Drupal will grab the string of words that you've typed in in the title tag and create a URL path for you. Therefore, you can have a custom URL path that is keyword rich and focused. This makes it easy and efficient for the Googlebots, Yahoo Slurps, and even humans to follow. The third reason that Drupal is SEO friendly is the internal link structure. In this mind map, you can see that I'm using the metaphor that a tree is basically your website. The tree trunk that you see in the pink below is actually your home Drupal web page. Your directories would be represented by the tree branches. The actual pages of your site or nodes would be represented by the leaves. As the Googlebot crawls up the tree from the roots like a spider, the spider will give you a good page rank depending on if you took the time to get a piece of paper and the spider will give you a good categories container using Drupal taxonomy. Creating a stable structure using, using internal linking by assigning the most themed vocabularies, terms, and containers will actually do you good in the long run. If you do not know what these terms mean, don't worry. In a later tutorial, I will go into detail what they mean. If the internal structure of how pages can be linked by the correct categories, you will be rewarded not only with a high page rank, as well as good rankings. Therefore, I cannot emphasize how important it is to Containers will actually do you good in the long run. If you do not know what these terms, internal pages of your Drupal website can be interlinked to each other. For instance, Drupal's powerful taxonomy system. You will notice that Drupal has a friendly internal link structure. When you construct a strong foundation of a house, you can live in it for many years, just like when you invest the time to construct the small pieces of categories pointing to the pages that you're optimizing for, you will be rewarded handsomely. From these container or category pages you create for each node type, 
visitors as well as Googlebot can crawl through to view the permanent pages of that node type. By downloading taxonomy breadcrumb and other cookie crumb modules, you can structure your content like a tree hierarchy, which is explained in a later taxonomy tutorial. The other excellent SEO-friendly feature of Drupal is that you can create unlimited containers or categories for each content type, whether it be a forum, a poll, blogs, articles, video blogs, podcasts, pages, events, etc. In this mind map, I've created a diagram to show you how certain pages, internal pages of your Drupal website, can be interlinked to each other. For instance, let's say you have built a Drupal martial arts website that talks about internal martial arts. As you write more articles about your experience learning Tai Chi, Drupal will automatically create a page that shows you all of the Tai Chi articles or Bargua articles that you have written. As you build new pages, Drupal will link to the important parts of your Drupal site, which links to other important pages. This way, the page rank you're rewarded by Google can flow through in a symmetrical fashion to your Drupal site correctly. The fourth reason that Drupal is SEO friendly is that the cascading style sheet resides in a completely separate folder called themes. So unlike a regular HTML web page, which I discussed earlier, your code is tidy and clutter free. This allows the Googlebot to index your content or nodes more efficiently. The bottom line is that your site will stand out from the crowd because your images and other messy code will not appear on every page or node, therefore removing any confusion from the Googlebot point of view. The fifth reason that Drupal is SEO friendly is the robot.txt file, which I've pointed in the blue arrow. In this file, out of the box, Drupal does not allow the Googlebot, Yahoo, Slurp, and any other search engine bots to crawl your submission pages, search pages, forms that you've created. You don't have to do anything extra for this to occur. In this file, out of the box, Drupal does not allow the Googlebot, Yahoo, Slurp, and any other search engine bots to crawl submission pages, search pages, and forms that you've created. You don't have to do anything extra for this to occur. This component allows the page rank to be spread to more focused pages that you're trying to rank, and therefore the page rank will not leak to irrelevant pages. Thank you. This concludes the why Drupal is SEO friendly tutorial and I welcome you to come back repeatedly to listen to it over and over again because there are some complex concepts that I've covered. Thank you. Practice random acts of kindness to your visitors on your Drupal website by putting compelling content on it so everyone can